Hey guys, you're Chris, and welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see from the title on this series of Myel Organics, today I will be trying a new product on my hair and I will definitely be doing a review at the end of this video. So if y'all wanna see how I achieve this look, stay tuned for this video and keep on watching. All right, y'all, so first things first, I'm going to start off by showing you guys what I'll be using. I'll be doing the liquid oil cream method. Everything is listed in the description box below. Honestly, I am sorry for my lash glue. It is so wet. So I'm coming out of the shower, and I have four sections. Within my four sections, I am going to split the section within two. So after I split it within two, I'm going to clip that up, and then I'm going to do the lock method. I'm going to do the liquid, which is my water, and an actual leave-in on top of that, just to make sure that it is saturated and wet. Then I'll use an oil to seal in that moisture. Then I'll use my cream. After you guys see me use my cream, I'll do a little detangling at the ends if I feel like the section needs it. After I'll do that, I'll put the gel on to make sure that the gel goes on smooth. So just watch right here. You guys see me using it for the first time. So it's like a little hard to come out. So after I did that, you guys will see me work it within the section. Sometimes I'll have like a heavy hand because you know, I am gonna have this style for a week. So within the gel, as I use the gel, I'm gonna start off on my roots. Within my roots, I'm going to make sure that it is coated and I'm gonna make sure that my ends are coated as well. And then after I finish working it from the roots and then I'm gonna work it to the ends and then I'm gonna work it throughout the whole section. All right, so you guys see how juicy my curls look. I'm going to repeat the same exact step throughout each section, making sure that I'm taking my time getting my roots, getting my ends, making sure that it looks good and the product, you know, lasts for the week. Yes, it is white right now, but I promise you it will dry clear. I am feeling this hairstyle. So just stay tuned for the end results. All right, so now that we're at the top, our final and last section, as you guys can see, my curls, they are looser at the top, but that is okay. I'll show you guys that this product still makes your curls pop. So I am still doing the liquid oil cream method. I did my water, then I did some detangling. Now I'm going in with my leave-in spray. After that, I'm going to go in with some oil, make sure that I rake that throughout the section to make sure that I'm sealing in that moisture. After I do that, I am gonna go in with some cream, yes. I know it is a lot of cream, but as I said before, this hairstyle is gonna last me a week, so I need to make sure that my hair is moisturized within this section. After I did that, I'm going to go in with some gel. Now with the gel or the product, I'm gonna make sure I rake it through the top on my roots, and then I'm gonna go throughout the ends, and then I'm gonna rake it throughout the whole section. Some sections, you guys see me putting extra gel within the roots just to make sure that it can last throughout the week and it's not frizzy or puffy at the top. And then you guys will see me go in later with my comb or my brush just to make sure that my curls can pop or if I have to finger detangle the section, I will do that. All right, so for this wash and go, I want to go for a side part, a deep side part. So I'm just going in with my comb and just making sure that my part is clean. And then as I told you guys before, you guys will see me go in with the brush. You guys will see me go in with some extra product just to make sure that my roots are laying down and making sure that my curls are popping. And then you guys will see me go in with some edge control. You guys can use any edge control of your choice. And that is it. You guys will see me go in with a bobby pin to make sure that my hair stays on the side and just stay tuned.
All right, y'all. So let me do a 360 so you guys can see how my hair looks. I I love it. And y'all, like, it gives me, uh, like, it gives me a gel hold and it looks like a mousse, if that makes sense. So um, first things first, let's talk about what I use. I did use the Myel Organics, the Coil Sculpting Custard. I've heard great things about this product. Um, let's talk about the smell. 10 out of 10, highly recommend. I mean, yeah, you shouldn't use products when it comes to like this scent and all that, but I like to smell good, so that's that. I must say when I did use this product, it was like to the top and that was like low-key halfway. I think I was a bit too much heavy-handed. I probably have two more uses out of this, so it's probably like three wash and goes within one. So I don't know how that really works. I could have been using it heavy-handedly. But on the um, jar itself, it says deep definition. And then if y'all can see, if y'all didn't watch my video on my Myel Organics um, haul, yeah, I suggest you go look for it. It is in the description box below. So on here, it says like the definition and it goes all the way to the end where it's like deep hold. And then I would definitely say this probably gives you like a 10, like a one out of 10, a 10 hold. So I'm definitely gonna see how it lasts on my hair throughout the day. I am about to go out in the sun and then I'll record videos and give you guys an update and all that stuff. But from what I can see, it looks good to me. The consistency of it, it reminds me of a flaxseed gel. Like if y'all was to make your own flaxseed gel on the stove and it gives you like that, you know? When I did put it on my hair, that's how it felt. And then like, I guess a little does go a long way. But since it is my first time using this product, I wanted to make sure that my curls has enough hold for the day because I don't want to go out looking crazy. You know what I'm saying? So yeah and then the next thing i did use from the myel organic is a curl smoothie i don't know if you guys seen but i was heavy handed on this product this one says soft definition it does have some type of definition on it like when i was putting it on my hair i did see my curls pop but it wasn't gonna hold it forever that's why i put that gel on top and then this one is has like the second level of the soft hold but this smells amazing as well and I would say I did put a lot because I'm going to have this hairstyle for a week do like updos and different stuff with this product. So I do want to make sure that my hair is moisturized. And then my oil of choice, I did use the Myel Organics Rosemary Mint Scalp Oil. And it's a strengthening oil as well. And it is infused with biotin. So if y'all want y'all hair to grow, edges grow back, highly recommend. I, I think this is like my third or fourth bottom using this. So I would definitely highly recommend Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Please like, comment, share, subscribe this video out to y'all friends that don't know about Misha Curls, what I am doing on this channel. Stay tuned for this series that I am doing on the Myel Organics line that I ordered. Again, if you did not see the haul that I ordered like a whole bunch of stuff from Myel Organics when they had like their little sale, it is in the description box below. And I will be doing like different wash and goes, different styles with their different products in my hair. So stay tuned for that. This will be like series one, I guess. And then I'll probably try to do like a twist out or a little washing, not a wash and go, cause this is a wash and go. I'll do like a braid out or a twist out or a little something like a little, we gonna see, we gonna see. Stay tuned for all the videos that's about to come out and I'll see you guys on Sunday at two o'clock. Thank y'all so much once again. And I will see y'all later.